What's good, YouTube land? That word collector here. It's been a while since I've done a wrestling action figure, but let's get back into it with this Elite Collection WrestleMania Kevin Owens. So, take a look. You got the uh, WrestleMania, most recent WrestleMania sign, I believe. KO here, the United States title, Elite Collection logo, a picture of KO right there. The better full uh, upper torso shot of KO. Uh, John, the others in the line, in the wave: John Cena, Bruce the Barber Beefcake, Randy Orton, and KO himself. Randy Orton contain comes with the uh, WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Brutus comes with, I believe, his mask and the scissors, and John Cena comes with the shirt. I'm tempted to pick up the Randy Orton because I need a better WWE Championship, and. I also want a Randy Orton, but I like Kevin Owens a lot, so I picked him up, and also, I'm going to just get this open off, kind of off camera, so to speak, like, like, a, like, as a kid, I bought, I, uh, my parents let me, well, my parents bought me a set of, basic, of the title belts. Basically, you get, went on WWE.com, and they had a collection of the belt, like the uh, this exact style of belt. It was the WWE title, the tag titles, the women's title, the United States title, the World Heavyweight title. You just check out the background right there. So I got all those, and unfortunately, they had basically no paint on them. They were all just solid, like gold-colored plastic. Which was cool for a while, but it kind of sucked when I looked at them on the TV and was like, but I want mine to look like that. So here's KO. With his uh, KO 2 Mania shirt on. And here is the United States title, beautifully done. Beautiful. So, there is another way to get KO with the United States title. There's a Festival of Friendship set where he comes with Chris Jericho and all the uh, props to make the, whoa, the Festival of Friendship. And that United States title I looked at, and the only real difference is the W's are uh, bo have black behind them, which, from shots of the actual belt is a bit more accurate but that one's also really expensive so I took this this one instead let's see if it'll actually no it does not fit around his waist that is very unfortunate well can I actually get the shirt off I don't actually think his shirt will come off like it's too tight oh well this god I'm making a fucking <laughs> mockery of myself as a YouTuber. Although YouTube's doing that itself as well. I believe this comes from not this past WrestleMania, but I think WrestleMania 33, where Kevin Owens fought Chris Jericho for the United States title and beat him, and then went over to SmackDown and had the most amazing version of it entrance we've ever heard. Uh, I'm not quite pausing the video to show you that. Let's check out KO. It's not a bad render of Kevin Owens. It's basically the same face sculpt as the uh, Festival of Friendship one, so if you're looking at which one is better, they're basically the same head sculpt. 
it's not it's not terrible. It just doesn't quite capture his intensity. It kind of looks a bit more meh. <laughs> dull is kind of the expression I'd say for this. Articulation wise, the head can swivel basically all the way around, go up and down a little, waggle a little, shoulders are free. Oh, that joint feels a bit stiff. Maybe it was just stuck, but you can go all the way out. America! America! Now! <laughs> uh, bicep swivel. 90 degree elbow. He's got the tattoo right there. The wrist hinge that's also on a swivel. And feels like it'll unpeg m more easily than I want. But you can get basically that full range. Even as a uh, his tattoos on his knuckles. He's got the bull making fun of the rock on the other arm. That's the only tattoo there. Hips can go about that forward, that far forwards, not not far backwards. He does have the KO with the O as an octagon because he's the prize fighter. Do you have a thigh swivel? Do you have a 90 degree knee bend? And you got you got a boot swivel, got it. Ugh, toe joint, which is a bit tight, but it can go forwards and backwards. So he's basically your your regular posability. Here I'll stand him next to Seth Rollins. I'll put in Finn Balor. Give you a Stone Cold as well. I believe, yeah, I've also reviewed Dolph, Dolph Ziggler. I believe these are all the guys I've reviewed so far. And they're, you can see how basically they're all the same, except KO has just a bit more meat on him in the stomach and the uh, arms. And, well, and he's also wearing shorts, which is slightly different. But it's, the thing I keep saying is all of these reviews, it's all of the character. What's important in an action figure for the WWE style is the character. If you like the character, then there's definitely an action figure of him out there for you. Whether it's in the Elite Collection or the Basic Collection. One day I will probably... Sh uh, show off the differences between the Elite Collection and the basic ones other than just them actually coming with accessories so uh, let's go IC title obviously Seth Rollins is my current uh, Universal Champion there's the WWE title who did the, that came with Seth Rollins with the money in the bank where is my money in the bank there's my money in the bank. But, yeah. I like... I definitely like KO. Kev if I had to uh, mirror myself after any other, any wrestler, it would probably be Kevin Owens. Just because he's not your typical bodybuilder. He was more of an average <laughs> fat guy. Even though he's not even that fat anymore. Watching him wrestle recently, he's lost, he's not even fat, he's just like, kind of skinny now, it's weird, because <laughs> there was that story line a while back where the commentators were making fun of Kevin Owens' weight, which is very unfortunate, but Kevin Owens, he is a good addition, if you like KO, I definitely recommend the action figure of him, I don't think it's a, uh, yeah, it is belly. It's <laughs> gotta be certain. Gotta look right up there. Oh, right. I forgot. He has a waist swivel. <laughs> I completely... Uh, yeah. Even has fight on the other side of shorts. But, uh, that's it for Kevin Owens. It's very simple. I wanted the United States title. I wanted a figure of Kevin Owens. And I got both of those. If, you're, if those are things you're looking for, I recommend them. If you want a bit more... Go for the Festival of Friendship with Chris Jericho and all the set pieces. I might, I may do that 
I'm not 100% sure. I may go for that set at some point. And the Randy Orton. Although I've never reviewed him, here's my Seamus. I might have done a blind bag uh, thing early in my YouTube where I just pulled uh, pulled action figures out of the bag and reviewed them. I might have reviewed Seamus. Not 100% sure. But uh, thank you for watching. Hope you have enjoyed. Until next time, it's time to kick out. Keep it weird! America, 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 America.